Tonight, we are learning new details about a deadly plane crash at this Mesa golf course. New radio traffic tonight may shed some insight to what could have happened inside that cockpit. I'm having, still having an electrical issue. I had one on Friday, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm about to go dead. Tonight, police have now identified the name of that pilot, and as CBS 5's Carissa Planup reports, he was known across the valley for his giving spirit. And uh, he was hilarious. He was funny. And he was relentless. Alan Ram helped pay for this cafeteria to transform the old food city into the Children First Leadership Academy. This is one of our uh, great foundations. Assistant Superintendent Jerry Lewis recalls a chance meeting between Alan and a fifth grader. He talked to them uh, in our principal's office. And he became intrigued at the boy's story. The, the boy, like many of the nearly 300 students attending the charter, lived in poverty. When he walked in, he was shocked. One bed, multiple families sharing a motel room, one bathroom, one bed. Um, and he, he just immediately said, there's got to be something I can do here. Before long, Alan rallied other donors to place the family in a condo. He was able to take them on flights up to Sedona and, and show them part of life that they would never be able to see. Alan's life may have ended in tragedy, but his legacy lives on in these walls. Alan had a heart that loved to help. In South Phoenix, Carissa Planelp, CBS 5 News.